Hello everyone, and welcome back to Trom. Alright, so what do we got this time? Get out of the house! Oh dang! <laughs> I guess we better do that. Alright. Is that a monkey? What's happening? This isn't my backyard. This can't be real. A monkey? Okay, that's it. I'm officially insane. The axe. There's an axe in the shed. I'm going to bust through the front door. Talk to the... He's actually a cute little fella. What is this even? <laughs> it's like a lawn ornament. Here we go. I'm going through the front door. Hospital bed? We didn't put anything in, though. Oh, okay. Alright, door. Get ready to meet your maker. No, the axe just shattered. This isn't real. I'm dreaming all this. I had to be dreaming. Wake up, Mike. Wake up. <laughs> a letter. The mirror will show the way. The mirror. Oh, goodness. We're going through a mirror. This is clearly a dream. Just a dream, right? There's a mirror in the bathroom. Might as well check it out. You look at the mirror. Can't see anything. You take a deep sigh of relief. Hey, you. Uh, yes, you. Come here. Did you know you're losing your mind? I am talking to a mirror, so that's a decent enough cue. No, really, what the hell is this? What? You've never talked to yourself before. That's what it is, after all. Nope, not doing this. Not at all. Don't be stupid, Mike. Come back. No. Where would you even go? You can't get out of this house. Come back, let me help you. Come on, Mike, be a good sport. Let's get through this together. You know I can help you. I can't believe I'm doing this. Okay, let's hear it then. What the hell is going on? Am I dreaming all this, and how do I get out of here? One thing at a time, Mike. Let's not get hasty. Nothing, really. I expected more from you. But fine. No, you're clearly not dreaming. If you were, you'd be able to wake up, right? You're asking me? I thought you had answers. God, I'm arguing with a mirror. There's always a good time for self-studying, Mike. Nothing wrong with that. Right. But as you know, uh, you cannot get out. Doors won't open, windows are unbreakable, and the backyard, well, let's just not talk about the backyard. But there is a way out. We can do this if we work together. Cooperation is key, after all. Okay, let's hear it. Like I have anything to lose. Do you remember what she did to us? What? Her, don't you remember? Think about it, Mike. Remember. What are you... Is that our flashback? What? Wait, those are credits on the TV screen. They're so small. Hi, honey. You're home already. How was work? It was okay. How was yours? Had to work overtime, it seems. Overtime? Oh, it's that late? I didn't even notice. So, what took you so long? Went, went somewhere? No, why? Oh, nothing. I was just wondering why it took you several hours to come home. You didn't even call. I didn't know I had to, um, I had some sort of schedule to follow. I'm sorry, I didn't mean anything. I was just worried. That something might have happened to you. That's sweet of you to worry. You know it's a takeaway coffee cup in your wife's hand. What's that? I thought you said you didn't go anywhere. What? I had a cup of coffee, okay? What's with you today? Did you go there by yourself? I'm not even gonna answer that. Your wife received a text message which she reads and smiles. Who's that from? Just someone at work. Why? No reason. You just seem happy about it. You know, I'm just gonna go, um, go and get a shower, okay? What the hell? What does she have to, um, what does she have to do with this? What have you done to my wife? Me? I'm just a mirror, Mike. I haven't done anything. But has she? Go on, Mike. Trust your gut. What? In the kitchen, Mike. Go to the kitchen. It will hold answers. The kitchen. Okay. On, oh, Mike. Tread carefully. You're not alone in this house. Oh, are we finally gonna get monsters? Ooh. 
Yeah, this is... I don't... We go back up? Oh. Oh! Uh, what the hell is happening? Smallings, M. C-O-D unknown. Okay. Oh! Oh, it's looping! Oh, this is interesting. Well, the kitchen is up this way. Yeah. Wait a minute. I remember these flowers. Honey, I'm home. Easy day at work, so they let me leave early. Honey? How are you? Are, are you here? She's not home. She should be by now. What's this? Flowers? What the hell? The bouquet is filled with roses and looks very expensive. You notice a car on the table. You pick it up. Thanks for being there for me. I really needed that. Not, no one understands me as, as you do, Irma. I know I can never repay any of that, but please take these flowers as thank you. Let's talk again soon. You're in my thoughts. Your lover. The fuck? Who the hell? And why is she... Why is he sending her fl Sending flowers to my wife? Where is she? I need to talk to her. You hear faint giggling in the backyard. I know, they're very beautiful. You didn't need to do that, honest. Come on, don't uh, don't say I like don't say it like that. We definitely need to do that again. Yes. She's talking to him, I just know it. Clench your fist and feel your heart racing. Why is she doing this to me? I remember him. Okay, let's think about all this. This, all of this, is just a dream. It has to be a dream. What are dreams anyway? They're, uh, they're just projections of your own subconscious, right? Maybe my subconscious is trying to tell me something. The mirror said something about wanting uh, me to, to remember. But what? Hey, don't those people who know, um... Don't those people who know they're dreaming get some sort of control over it? I want to try this. Maybe you can make the toaster levitate. Are we going to be lucid dreaming? Like, why not? I mean... <laughs> you try your hardest, but the toaster won't move at all. Well, that was disappointing. Hmm. And, th oh, oh. What the fuck is that? Is that a... Oh, I can't, okay, I can't hit that. Um. Hello? I'm very sorry, Mr. Smalling. Okay. <laughs> this is a cool light effect. I like this a lot. Come on, Mike, we're late for the party. The oh, fuck, Smalley, how can you fuck this up? Oh no, we hit a dead end. You know, I appreciate that running into the monster isn't a game over. It just resets you a little bit. But, can I not? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, so I'm clearly meant to go somewhere. What's that teardrop mean? Does that mean like I hit a dead end? Are you in the bathroom again? Maybe my shadow can help me. Oh, there we are. Holy mother of... I'm stuck here, there's no way out. Is this how it really ends? Hey Mike. Did you find the answers? Are you remembering? Look, I don't have time for your damn riddles, I need help. Help? Yes, I'm stuck here and something is very eager to come see me. What? I don't know if it uh, if that door will hold. Do something. Oh, this wasn't supposed to happen. What? Let me think for a moment. I don't have a moment for a uh, moment, you stupid piece of reflecting glass. Help me. Okay, fine. I'm really not supposed to do this, but I can't let you fail. Not now. Not when you're so close. What do you mean? Come on. Huh? Come on, Mike, jump through. What the hell are you talking about? Look, you're out of time. Jump through the mirror. That's the only way. Sure. Here goes nothing. Oh! 
What happened? Did I just jump through? Wait, this is my bathroom. I thought... Holy shit, where the hell am I? Wait. It's the it's in the mirror. I can see it. Or it can see me. Behind the mirror. It's like this isn't a mirror, but a window. The thing is just wander... The thing, that thing just wanders there. It doesn't look like it can see me. Where's the eyes? Jesus, that's all seriously wrong. I need to get out of here. Is that like an actual texture or an NPC? I move to the right. Huh, I can't tell if that's a texture or like an actual like... Like, a vent behind the mirror or something. Something is oozing out of the vent and I'm sure as hell I'm not gonna touch it. Okay. What? Where is this place? Some sort of warehouse? I don't think we've been here before. Oh no, I think we've been to a place like this. This wheelchair looks familiar. Uh, and it's glowing, so they'd have clearly want me to touch that. This looks so wrong. I don't want to be here. There's blood everywhere. Irma. Oh, we have the torn shirt again. Is that you? Make us whole, Mike. Make us whole. What? What do you mean, Irma? There's some text on the screen. Liar. Some bloody papers. There's a Bible on the table. It's partially burned. That's not a good sign. I need to get out of here. <laughs> okay, I thought I thought that bloodstain was giving me the Gotham hand for a second. <laughs> so, yep. Yeah. Why are the doors pastel colors? Oh! Oh, do we have a lost wood section? Okay, that's strange. Some cabinet still with paper. Not really interesting. Nothing on the shelf. Um, I really, really don't want to know what happened here. Bundle of flowers. Some of them are soaked in blood. Is that the doctor? Accept it, Mike. You have to accept it. Huh? It says Lynn on the canister. No idea what it is. Nothing here, just some empty boxes. Irma. Thank you, Mike. Irma! You vanished. Good job, Mike. Oh, another flashback. As you walk through the door, you hear your wife speaking to someone. You don't recognize the other voice. They're a bit too far away for you to make out what they're saying. Who the fuck is this guy? There's someone talking to my wife in my home. Damn, I can't hear what they're saying. I should sneak closer. I have to be careful. I don't want them to see me. There, I can hide behind those bushes. Wow, that is so, that was so amazing. How come I've never seen you do that before? You liked it. I just wanted to try something new. Did I like it? I loved it. You really need to do that more often. Irma turns at the man and smiles. You feel disgusted at the sight. You're also unable to get a clear view of his face, which annoys you even more. As my lady commands, I shall obey. Can we go back inside? It's really chilly out here. I know a few activities that, uh, that can keep you warm. You do? Yes, I do. You're quite adventurous. You're quite adventurous lately. Why? I thought I should uh, spice things up a bit. Did it work? Oh, yes. Back in my office, just the place where I want to be. It's my desk. There are many, many like it, but not, but this one is mine. You laugh at your own joke. Hilarious. Chris? Whoa! He doesn't have a face. But what are they doing in here? Do you remember their names, or have you already forgotten? Think on him, Mike. He's gone. Do I remember their names? I'm not sure if I remember them all, but their desks might give me a clue. I've never seen this man. I have no idea who he is. Oh, I actually need to... Wasn't he fired? Nothing stands out. Oh, how come you never spend any time with your wife, Mike? I'm not excited. I'm not. Ex I'm not exciting enough. I guess that one. This guy looks like Tommy Wiseau. He slumped in place and looks like he slumped in place. Looks like something is wrong. I wonder what his problem is. It's not Edward. Wasn't the character he played named George? Oh my goodness. I asked for your help, Mike. I asked for it and you didn't move a finger. Because of that, I couldn't finish the contract. It's your fault they let me go. 
Okay. So, okay. This is kind of cool, actually. I like this puzzle already. You can kind of guess and go through it if you just want to continue the game, but there is a little bit of, like... <laughs> you can do a little bit of sleuthing yourself. James? That probably was his name. Skinny guy. Lots of dandruff. Doesn't talk much. Joyce. Breaks a perfume, which is causing me a headache. Evelyn. She got... She got promoted after having a private chat with the boss. Now it's an empty desk. Jim worked here. I don't think I've seen... I've ever even spoken to him. Is that Jim? These three are women, and this is the only male name we have left. Or G I think Jim is the only male name we have left. Yeah, okay. You never talked to me, but I never asked... You, you never asked how I was doing. Why? That's a lot of dandruff. Oh, wait, no, there's also this guy. Um, Jim? Oh, good, I'm bad at remembering this sort of thing. James, right. That book was not meant for you, Michael. You shouldn't uh, snoop around so much. In these three. That's a lot of perfume. Why you always kept uh, your distance from me? Don't you like me? It's okay, I don't like you either, smelly pants. <laughs> okay. I think you look stunning. Evelyn? I slept with uh, Jonathan so he would promote me, and I carry his seed within. That means more money for me. I wasn't the only one. And the last name. What the hell is she wearing? That dress looks like it's picked from the dumpster. Uh, Joyce? Wait, no. Kate. All my money goes to my mother's medical bills. I, I don't like, um, I don't like the way you always judge me. You don't know me. And everyone? Everyone's at their desk now, okay. You'll never get out. All she wanted was, uh, to, was to start a family. You're a failure. Worthless. She found a happy happiness somewhere else. You know, she lied. You should have searched everywhere. She loves you. Why'd you do it? She tried to understand. Did you even love her? Her report was a mess. How can you be so bad at your work? She called. You were talking to taking out the trash. Spineless. Sibling worthless. You shouldn't have joined the swim club. There is no escape. Remember. I'm surprised I kept up with reading that that well. All of that was automatic, by the way. <laughs> Remember what happened. I see you've been busy lately, making new friends. Um, what? What are you talking about? Don't lie to me, Irma. I saw you with him again. What? You saw me with who? Where? When? Stop, just stop. He was here. You can't deny it. I saw you two talking, holding hands. Mike, you're scaring me. I have no idea what you're talking about. Saw me with who? Mike, please stop. You're hurting me. Oh no. Just admit it. Admit it. Say that he was here and I'll let you go. Mike, for the love of God, I don't know what you're talking about. Let me let go of me, please. Uh, God should be capitalized in that context. Sorry, I'm so... I didn't mean to hurt you. Please forgive me, I was out of line. Please don't go. Don't leave me. Oh no! Talk to me, what is wrong with you? What is all this? You're really scaring me. I'm so sorry. Hey, this is a lot more emotional than the stuff I normally play. Like, it's... I feel out of my league right now. I feel like this is out of my league right now. Where am I now? All right, back to spooky stuff. Um, in front of you is a lever. If you pull the lever, one of your friends will die, but you'll be safe. You can also not pull the lever. But they also have a lever. If either one of them pulls it, one of you will die, and he or she will be safe. Oh good, it's it it's 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 the Ambidex game. <laughs> if all of you pull the lever, you will all die. If none of you pull the lever, you will all die. What will you do? I oh god, this This is the Ambidex game. Uh, I hope that's that's actually what it's called. I haven't played um Virtue's Last Reward in a while. I love Virtue's Last Reward, by the way. I'm gonna pull Yeah, and the heartbeat in the soundtrack does not help either. Dang, this is a good... I trust my wife. Like, I, I grew up in a family where you're taught to always trust your family. 
The other guy, I don't know, he's kind of a jerk, but I can tell he kind of means well. I'm gonna pull it. Oh! No, this is not real. I refuse to believe that this is real. I have to keep going. Can I pull it again? No. <laughs> it's locked. It's Chris. No, this is not real. I suppose you can't read that. So where were you going again? Mike, I already told you this. I'm meeting my sister down the street. She'll pick me up and we and we go for a coffee. Your sister, huh? Yes, my sister. You know, I kind of want to fan edit this game or this footage to try and, like, re uh, reorganize it in the chronological order. Because every time I see um, a story that goes all over the place like that, I'm always tempted to try something like that. I saw someone do that with a movie called Memento once, which is a movie all about a guy with short-term memory loss. So, like, the story was told in reverse, and, like, the twists actually made a lot of sense and were really cool when told in that order. I don't know. Why down the street? Why, uh, why don't she pick you up from here? You know why. She's not really that fond of you, Mike. Not after she saw the bruise. I already said I was sorry, Irma. Okay, so this was after that. I know. Now is not a good time. Can I call you later? Who is it? I'll call you later. Who was it? Tell me. It was my mother, alright? Can you please just calm down? You're starting to sound paranoid again. I'm sorry, just... I need to know so I can be at ease. You know how things are, alright? I'm going to go now. My sister is probably waiting for me already. I'll be back in a few hours. So, see you then. Okay, see you then. Love you. You're not sure if that smile is sincere. Her sister? Sure, sure it was her sister. I know it was him. She's going to meet him. I could check her computer. There's gotta be something hidden within that infernal machine. Browsing history, marriage counseling, forums, my husband suspects me of cheating. He doesn't treat me right, something is wrong with him. You should leave him. Comment upvote 70, uh, plus 73. What is this garbage? Is this Reddit? Comment upvote. <laughs> Looks like she's uh, she's asked for advice on r slash relationships. Um, she's got a lot of emails from her sister, her mother, and some guy. It's that guy. That fucking guy. Thanks for being with me tonight. Thank you for the support. The meeting in in the warm hugs. I'll never forget the place where we uh, we had our first kiss. You look absolutely stunning. I hope we can uh, keep meeting like this. I love you, Orma. Your lover. I don't know that he doesn't say his name ever in the emails or any of the messages. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch. Alright, what do we got now? Um, We're back at the office. Stuff all over the floor. It, it's dirty. It's not too dirty, but it's enough to be noticeable. It looks like the door into our office is gone. What the? Oh, I know this door. Wait, I can hear the noises coming from there. Is he... Is this our boss? <gasps> She's cheating on us with our boss! Where do you want me to throw these? To the trash where they belong. You see your wife throw something in the trash, they look like panties. Irma, what are you- why are you- yeah, what are you doing there? Get away from him. Oh, hi honey, didn't expect to see you. How have you been? There you are, smallings, finally. Smalling, is it true? You can't perform? Irma, please, get away from him. This is unaccept- that is unacceptable, Smalling. No employee of mine is allowed to be inferior, damaged. But you see, Smalling, because you can't do it, I must. As your boss, I have to take responsibility, and because I am such a good person, I will do it for you. This is, um, this is redacted from your next pay, of course. Uh, nothing is free. I love how you're taking control, Mr. Williams. Uh, it's making me very excited. Get away from her, uh, you fuck. Leave her alone. Smalling, get out of my office. Whoa! I have to save Irma. It's locked now, isn't it? Yep. Oh, no, it's not! What the... Oh, hi, Mike. Hello, Mr. Smalling. I'm afraid you are interrupting an important examination. I have to ask... I have to ask you to leave. What is all this? Why is this happening? 
Ah, good question. As you already know, having a child is a difficult process. For healthy couples, it may take uh, years and years. Oh, doctor, just cut to the chase. Let's make it happen. He's having a complex about... So he's dreaming about every man he knows. Yeah, he's not sure who he is, so he's just kind of speculating that it could be everyone. That is surprisingly... Re that is, like, actually kind of realistic of... Of, like, situations like this. That is... Interesting. Mr. Smalling, it's a common practice for doctors to do whatever they can to help their patients. Please leave the room and let the professionals do what they do best. You'll see the results in nine months, and th as this procedure has a success rate of over 99%. No, why is this happening? Why is, um, why is all this and why won't it stop? Is it gonna be Chris next? No. Oh, yes it is! Chris I didn't recognize the overall sprite. Jesus, Mike, you scared the crap out of me. Is that his catchphrase? Like, you can't just sneak up on people like that, especially when they're in the middle of something. What, um, why did you do this to me, Irma? I know, I know why you're, what you're talking, I don't know what you're talking about. Look, Mike, I'm not doing, I'm doing this for you. As your friend, I feel obligated to help you any way I can. And what better way is there to, uh, to help you get what you want? I can't let my friend down. You're such a good friend, Chris. Oh, so I am. What you mumping about there for, Kurt and Mike? This is uh, the way you uh, you both get what you want. Now go get some more of that wine. Irma, did you really do all this? Huh? Oh, now the way's open. Alright. Hmm, we're at 26 minutes. I think I'm going to leave it off here. Alright, I'll see you folks next time. Thanks for watching.